Hey there, today I wanted to showcase this uh, very cool steam silver round that we just uh, had the opportunity to take part in the um, in the making of. So steam's a cryptocurrency, so think, you know, Bitcoin, this and that. This is a, a silver round we made, it doesn't have any actual value in steam, but steam's a cryptocurrency and uh, it's traded on steam it, which is like a social media blog platform where you can you know post your post your blogs on there you know interact with each other and every time you get kind of like a like a thumbs up or an upvote it's worth worth a value based on uh you know how much that how much value how much value or wallet you know that other guy has invested in the platform i'll uh maybe i'll take you over there and do a little screen share and show you a little bit how it works because it's a great little thing but Anyways, this steam silver round is a really really cool round. So this guy here seven Wilson He was uh, talking about the idea he had one day to make kind of a steam a steam silver round He posted the idea He had some quotes from I think gold statement or a couple other places and uh, You know, he was gonna run with this idea and then uh, We've been we were active on there at the time we reached out to him and we we're like hey, man, we'd We'd love to be involved with that. We have, like, you know, the store infrastructure and that to deal with the, uh, you know, deal with all the transactions and this and that. We weren't, uh, at the time, we weren't dealing in USD and we weren't dealing in uh, uh, Bitcoin, which which was, uh, you know, the way a lot of these people wanted to pay. So we had to uh, hunker down and figure that out. So we did. And the site became fully operational in that. So, uh was an exciting and busy time for us and uh, we really appreciate that uh, seven wanted us to be involved so then we put out the uh he came up with kind of this design for the reverse you know this is the steam logo and it's kind of very uh, similar to the canadian maple leaf so it's got that appeal it's got the two colored waves so uh the mint we work with there they had this great idea of uh putting in Kind of this this different texture so it gives it the same kind of uh you know shaded look so that worked out good so what they did is they put a design contest out to the community and they had a, i think about eight or, eight or so different designs submitted and it was voted on all by the community and then they came up with this reverse design this is the winning design by a designer arlie she's in uh she's in australia she's a very active member there and we came up they came up with this community design so because you know steam is a social media platform it's all about the community there they came up with this so it's a you know an international community people from different languages so we have the uh you know the community and then i'm not even gonna you know mutilate these other languages but uh you know a few other languages and then in the middle we have kind of the fish so you know, everybody uses these kind of fish metaphors. So, you know, you start off like a little minnow then you get up to like a bigger little red fish. And then you get into a dolphin category and then you get into a whale. And that depends on just how much of this steam you hold. And then they put the logo here in the middle. And once again, the mint went over and above by just uh, proofing up that area in the middle. So it turned out really nice. And then the year, 2017, because the intentions are there's going to be a an annual release surprise we were quite surprised by the uh how excited everybody was about it so their uh a limited mintage of 1500 rounds and they actually sold out like right away within three weeks which was uh totally not what we were expecting so it was a very exciting project from that end i won't focus there it had it had that first but that went away anyways 1500 of them so they, like I say, they sold like that. They're all individually edge numbered. So you can see this is 300 and something from my my personal collection. So it was uh, very excited. So hopefully within the next uh, few months, we'll be starting, uh, next month or so, we'll be starting to look at the 2018 design. Right now, we're awfully busy over at Feli Mint with our next uh, 2017 Succubus, which releases on black friday this of course is an image of the 2016 we don't have any uh this kind of marketing material or stuff like that yet for uh 2017 but uh you know the images of the plaster are available over our website so 
head over there. And now I think what I'll do is probably uh, cut to a screen share all about uh, steaming and we'll just uh, give it a quick once over in case anybody's interested in uh, coming over there and checking it out. Okay, welcome back. Let's see if I can do this uh, justice here about how Steam it works. So like I say, it's a blog platform. What we're looking at here is my profile page. So from your blog, you can kind of see the blogs you've posted. So post a little bit about coins, a little bit about some other stuff here. So uh, you have that. You can navigate to your comments, your replies. It gives you a rundown of your uh, rewards you make. So you make rewards one of two ways. One way you make it through what they call curation, where every time you vote on somebody, you get a small percentage of their vote payout, and you make uh, a payout from authoring your blog. So if we look here, so we got you know this blog, this blog here, I made you know four on four dollars and forty six cents, or this one about twenty dollars and seventeen cents. They pay out seven days after they're posted. And then it gets transferred over here to your wallet. So you can see uh, you have your Steam dollars and your Steam power. So when your vote gets paid out, generally it gets paid out half in Steam dollars, half in Steam power. Like I alluded to earlier, this Steam power determines how much your vote is worth. So right now when I vote, I have around, you know, this 17, 1700 Steam power. So my vote may be worth. 12 cents or 15 cents every time I vote on somebody and uh, of course this theme is a cryptocurrency so it goes up and down in value since I've been blogging here in the last about four months it's fluctuated anywhere from I think just over a dollar a dollar and a half down to around 86 cents so it kind of fluctuates around there now it's fluctuating just under just under a dollar so it's been uh, a lower recently but it seems to be climbing slowly so we'll see what happens so here's how you navigate you can navigate kind of the trending pages so this is all kind of the biggest newest stuff and these people you know have uh, they're making some making some big money blogging but uh, not everybody does that so what I'll show you here is we'll go over to the feed so these are just people I follow these are kind of my friends that I'm following and then here's a nice, so you can follow different tags. So you can see this is a steam silver gold tag. It's a popular tag or the, the one main tag where the uh, silver and gold stackers kind of hang out. So we have a, we have a great little group, a great little group there, very supportive of each other. There may be a few, uh, or maybe a few names you recognize from uh, YouTube as well. A few of those guys, uh, migrated over here I mean they're still active on both but uh, it's been a very interesting platform it's worth uh, worth checking out if you do come over check in on this steam silver gold tag and anybody here would be more than happy to explain more about how it works it's it's uh, I mean it's it can be you know it's it's fun community to engage in but it's not going to uh, make you rich blogging at least not anytime soon like I say, it's a fun other it's another fun community for silver stackers to hang out and engage, talk about you know, talk about stuff. There's a little bit of buy and selling going on. It's just starting out. So uh it's been a really really fun platform. I'd say it's worthwhile to uh take a look at. A few things, I mean, you, you kind of have to wrap your head a little bit around cryptocurrency to use it. When you first come on, they give you this uh you know, gigantic 25-digit password, and they tell you don't lose it, but uh, that's important. You can't lose it because in the cryptocurrency world, all these keys, you know, there's no way to ever get them back, so you really got to back them up in 10 places and keep an eye on that stuff. But it's been uh, been an interesting opportunity to learn a little bit more about cryptocurrency and figure out what they're all about and, uh, you know, demystifying a little bit. But it's uh, it takes a little getting used to to start out. But it's uh, it's been fun. If you want to come over and uh, check it out, let us know. We're all here, and we're more than happy to uh, help you out. Thanks for uh, stopping by today. Please like, comment, and subscribe.